Welcome to the Morning Coast News at 6 o'clock. Today's date is March 27, 2007. and agreed to do the news at this hour. That was only because of the cute chamomile cake. Hi, Manuela. Manuelo? You're not Manuelo. Oh. Manuelo? Okay. Let me see. It's time to get back on track. Okay. <clears throat> Manuelo. In today's... Where's Manuelo? In today's... Today's news, we will give you a large overview of the eastern western plains. This region is a flat, well obviously, plains, hence the name coastal plains, as in simple and attractive, kind of like your taste and fashion. This is a geographical report, not a fashion one, aren't you fine? Well, I guess some people just don't care about how they look. I like me a lot less. As I was saying, this region is a fl This region has an average elevation of less than 200 meters above sea level. Can you believe that more than half of the coastal plains is less than 30 meters is above sea level and is mostly flat or gently rolling? rest in Rhode Island, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Maryland, Virginia, North and South Carolina, Georgia, Alabama, Florida, Mississippi, Arkansas, Louisiana, Texas, and Mexico. Now let's go to Ella for the update on the vegetation. Thank you, Jay. Temperate rainforest is typical in this province. Most of the region's numerous streams are sluggish. They are composed of marshes, swamps, and lakes that are numerous. Soils are mainly utilal soils, Spadola soils and entisols are mainly sandy. Since the coastal plains consist of many swamps, wet spongy land, and marshes, lowlands that is flooded in wet weather and almost always wet. Plants such as ferns, shrubs, herbaceous plants, such as Eubitorium dibidium and Lobelius syphilitica. Vines and wildflowers grow abundantly. These marshes and swamp also provide transportational routes Aquatic life forms like alligators and important sources of shellfish are located in this region. The fauna region provides habitat for a wide range of species of animals. Raccoons, opossums, flying squirrels, rabbits and numerous species of ground-dwelling rodents are common mammals. Hey, you put that slide there! That is all for the update on vegetation, soils and animals. Ella over and out. Well, but we're going to have to take a commercial break. Yeah, we sure need one. Who talks that much about vegetation, soils, animals? Okay. 
cares about soul flex, dirty and curtains, med medusols, first souls. Frankly, I don't give up. Pourquoi la plupart de Canadiennes énergiques, cool, intelligent et forte? Starbucks donne beaucoup d'énergie. Dans les situations de vous toujours découvrez une réponse. Time are supposed to be shooting. No, you're asking the wrong person. Like I know the time. Yeah, we're on. Oh, right now? Oh, um, okay. <clears throat> Welcome back to the Morning Coast News at six o'clock. It is now six fifteen. We will continue with information on topography. The Atlantic Ocean and the Gulf of Mexico border the coastal plains. It consists of two peninsulas: the Florida Peninsula and the peninsula found in Mexico. Oh, I know Mexico, Manuel is from Mexico. Yeah, I know. Believe me, I know. Oh, anyways, borders of the south are jagged and create natural ports. Excellent for trade and overall the economy itself. Oh, so that's how I get um, those Dolce & Gabbana, Fendi, Chanel, Dior, Bags, purses, accessories, pleated skirts, leather pants. Okay, yeah, we get it. You're a spoiled brat. Okay, yeah. Okay. You know, this isn't the news that we should be talking about. Just, why don't you just go sell your autobiography at ET or something? Fine, maybe I will. Do you want to tell me to my autobiography at ET? Jeez, no one ever tells me that. Two in, in a minute. 